Not that you don't already think I am crazy. Check this out. The moon always has the same face towards the earth. But as it moves around the earth, the sun goes around the moon effectively. Now we always talk about the dark side of the moon or and imagine that to be the side the other side of earth. In a sense it's dark because it's unknown to the majority of us what's on the other side of the moon. Now why does the moon always face the earth? The same way? Is it because that side of the moon is heavier and therefore has stayed like that position? And is it heavier because on the other side there's a massive crater, like huge, <coughs> which is actually an ideal place to build a base. And if you think the pictures of the other side of the moon, and I'm sure they were like dark, dark grey. <laughs> I might not be right about that. I might be making that bit up. I'm pretty sure in my atlas. I don't know. They could just be making it up, couldn't they? Craters here, there, yeah. They could just be making it up, because when they found it, they didn't want anyone to know. And the Chinese are very interested in the moon as well. They obviously want in on the action. And I've been hearing these sort of engine noises from the sky quite for quite a while now, for two or three years. <laughs> But um, there was a spate of them a few weeks ago, quite a lot. And it really does sound like something's coming in out of hyperspace. Ooh! And then going off into hyperspace again. Whee! And if I'm right about the thing that's coming, and, and I believe we're going to get a warning shot and it's going that's like Elijah I think Elijah almost Elijah I haven't really looked into it but when the prediction was I will send Elijah first it's like it's like the warning shot it's like the one that comes before so it will be both a man, it will be Elijah, the Elijah, and there will be an event as well, either a big earthquake or, or a meteor, I think this is possible. Some other type of major thing. And that will be like the warning shot. And then we'll have a certain amount of time, perhaps nine months. And it could be that the people elite with these noises I've been hearing in the sky are like there's some sort of advanced space shuttle that we've been kept unaware of. You know, this NASA space program has gone very quiet and Area 51's had weird stuff going on, hasn't it? And... Um, you know, they show us these failed attempts at rockets, in a sense, just to make us all think that, yeah, they're just going for a bad patch here, pretty stupid. <laughs> Whereas, in fact, they're managing to build an awesome base on the other side of the moon, which is perhaps how they feel they're going to escape. And and survive where in fact it will most likely cause their demise so that's that okay thanks bye